We can joke about a do-nothing Congress and the political gridlock in faraway Washington, D.C., but it's no laughing matter. And now, it's a matter of life and death. Hello, I'm James Cargus, and I'm running for the United States Congress in Congressional District 7. Last year, we learned about the Zika virus and the horrible birth defects it causes to developing babies. In February, the President asked Congress for $1.9 billion in emergency funding for mosquito control, treatment, and development of a vaccine. The Republican Congress shaved that down to $1.1 billion, and then, in August, left for a month-long vacation without passing anything. Not a penny. Let's be clear about another important aspect of this request. America's leading Zika vaccine research is happening here in our Texas Medical Center. The vast majority of that funding will come here to Houston. While the political blame game plays out in the papers and on TV, there have been 90 confirmed Zika cases in Texas two dead babies, one of them here in Harris County. The fact is the Republicans control the House and the Senate. Why can't they pass Zika research funding? Well, the fact is the House Republican leadership will not allow a vote on a clean Zika bill without adding any unrelated provisions to the Confederate flag, the Clean Water Act, or restrictions on Planned Parenthood. It's clear to me which political party puts games ahead of our health and ahead of our babies' health. I'm running because I am tired of a do-nothing Congress. I am tired of watching Republican House leadership play political games while mothers and their babies suffer from the threat of this terrible disease. I am James Cargus. I'll be honored to have your vote. I am James Cargus, candidate for U.S. Congressional District 7, and I approve this message.